Hey there, Jim Munchback with a very important announcement for my students of personal finance at the University of Houston at the Bauer College of Business. So we have really been looking forward to uh, this semester, the spring semester coming up. Um, I'm going to get off this bumpy road. This is probably not going to make a very good video announcement, but it is an important announcement. So I didn't want to delay. I wanted to kind of get a, get a message to you, my students, new enrollees this semester. Uh, we've been really excited about having an opportunity to be face to face. And uh, it's interesting over the last couple of years, as you know, we've had this challenge of, you know, trying to manage the um, spacing and, uh, you know, just trying to stay healthy. So we've been excited that this semester looked like the time we were going to be able to come back together and be face to face. But as you probably already know, the... Uh, the first couple of weeks of the spring semester in 2022 are now under uh, a different kind of uh, management. So we're being given, as instructors, we're being given uh, the flexibility to make some changes. So I wanted to announce the changes that we're going to make uh, in, in our class. However, I'm not really making us, you know, I'm not really making the... Uh, not making like a change I'm asking for your input here's my assumption and I may be wrong and I'm happy to be wrong but my assumption is because I've asked students before multiple times throughout the last couple of years I've asked students to share with me what do they think about the benefits of being in the classroom versus being online and and I was surprised because as a as an instructor, clearly it's much more um, effective to communicate face to face and to be with you in person. That's always been my preference. Uh, however, it was not my choice to go online. But when that time came, when we did go online a couple of years ago, at the last minute. I made it my mission to attempt to create an online course that produced a certain outcome. So the course objective stayed the same. The big idea has always been, and always will be, I wanna teach you how to become a millionaire by the time you turn 50. That's my goal. That's always been the goal. And each lesson, each homework assignment is designed to help you get closer to that goal. And that's something I feel very confident, very comfortable in teaching you uh, throughout the semester. And when we went online, I felt really good about the curriculum, about the way we were delivering the course. And so I feel very comfortable and confident that if we were 100% online, I could help you achieve the objective as effectively as if we were in person in the classroom. I believe that. I'm confident about that. I'm gonna get my car in park real quick here. I'm sitting in the street, just pulled off into the neighborhood, shut the car off. So up if somebody comes behind me to start the move. But anyway, I feel very confident about that global. I feel like that's not something that I have any doubts about. Uh, but on the other hand, I also appreciate, uh, I really appreciate the value of being face to face, being in the same room, getting to see your faces, because I don't get to see your faces when we do online teaching. You know, I don't require, I never required my students to turn their camera on. And when they did, I didn't really always appreciate what I saw because a lot of times you guys were uh, like me, you know, you're, if you can see I'm wearing shorts right now, which is too much information. So bottom line is there are pros and there are cons, and I'm not sure what you think about the idea of online teaching. However, I'm going to propose that we start the semester teaching online. I just can't commit to the complications that would be involved in trying to manage the space in the classroom. That's just too, 
it's I'm not really willing to take on that responsibility. So it looks like I've got three options as an instructor, and one of those options is to provide synchronous or asynchronous teaching. Uh, and by now, hopefully, you know the difference. Asynchronous means I'm going to do a Zoom meeting at a certain time, but you do not have to be there. So that's basically an online course. And that's what I think I'm going to do. I'm going to have a time every week on Tuesday at 10 a.m. where we get together in a Zoom call. And in that Zoom call, I will do the weekly lecture. I'll do it one time. And you'll be able to participate. You will be encouraged to be there on that Zoom call so that you can ask questions, make comments, give you know, give some feedback to me. So that's what we're, we're going to do to start out. However, I want you to leave a comment below. Uh, you should be watching this video. Hopefully, if you're watching it on YouTube in our YouTube channel, that's great. You can leave a comment there. Tell me what you think. Tell me how you feel about online course this semester. Would you prefer to be 100% online to do the asynchronous approach or would you prefer for us to come together and be in class? I'm gonna, I really want to know what you think, so I'm asking you to tell me what you think. But in the beginning, for the first couple of weeks, this is the important announcement. We will be teaching via Zoom, and you will be participating via Zoom once a week. You'll have a Zoom call. You'll be required to watch it if you can't be there because this is asynchronous. So if you can't be at the Zoom meeting, you will be required to watch the Zoom recording. I'll record it. I'll post it to YouTube uh, so that it's in your playlist in the course. And that will be a very important part of the course is to watch the Zoom meeting, the weekly Zoom meeting. In addition to that, I'll do a weekly review of your assignment to make sure that you know what you're what you're what what you're supposed to do and how you can get the most points from each weekly assignment. So that's how we're going to start the course. I'm sorry for the change, but this is an important announcement I wanted you to know. I wanted I wanted to look you in the eye and tell you that that's what we're going to do this semester to get started. So uh, that's going to be it for this uh, quick, important announcement. And I appreciate I'm thankful that you're here. I look forward to working with you, and I do hope we get to meet in the classroom, but I want to know, what do you think? Oh, I've got a car coming. Got to start up, get out of the way. So I want to know what you think, and if you will leave a comment below and tell me, do you prefer to be online, or do you like uh, in face-to-face, in, -face, in classroom instruction? What do you prefer? What is your vote? So leave your comments below and give me your vote and I look forward to seeing you soon don't forget to check out the special landing page that I created to tell you more about the course it's at moneystudygroup.com that's moneystudygroup.com that's a landing page and there will be lots of links in that landing page and one of the links that you will see frequently is enroll in the course